was a real bastardo, man. Don't like this at all. This porcelain bitch is the worst kind of news. I know. I'll be careful. Not exactly one of your strong suits. Listen, first sign of trouble, eat Delta. She emptied the place. Shit. Excellent. You have come. Thanks for meeting me. Of course, V. And I thank you. Before we discuss details, I feel I owe you an explanation. I must tell you why I changed my mind and wish to help. You weren't sure of anything. If you could trust me, if your Nobud killed your father, no? I knew. From the start. You... knew? All the board members knew. Not one soul even slightly interested in the matter believed in the poisoning. Details were disparate. Inconsistent. You knew? But didn't do a thing about it? Why? Suddenly sprout a conscience just yesterday? My father had flaws. I know this. I harbor no illusions about it. When a foe needed removal, my father ordered it without a thought to mercy. A way of being Yorinobu could not abide. But to my father, ends ever justified means. Saburo Arasaka has always valued just one thing. Do you know what it is? Ties that bind. Yes, family. I was to be its heart, to uphold life, ensure continuity, stability, never to oppose it. Huh? Guess Yorinobu's instructions were a little different? Yorinobu raised his hand against our father, but he is an Arasaka. He is family. I do not expect you to understand. I wish you merely to know I do not oppose my brother willingly. That it is difficult. Mm hmm He's your brother. It's been hard, it'll be hard. Let's say I get that. But what changed your mind? We received a warning during the parade. Security protocols were violated. The first doubts sprouted then. They grew yet greater in your hideout when my brother's assault group arrived not to rescue, but to kill. Yorinobu was just plain willing to sacrifice you. My father was right about my brother. He never cared for us. I was brought up to be the heart of the family. It is time for the Arasakas to listen to their heart. It will bring justice. Did you bring Soul Killer, as we agreed you Finger would? Finger on the trigger, don't say a word. Take me for a fool? Think I'd fall for that? Got plans to walk out of here alive. Had I any ill intentions, I would have chosen a side far more discreet than this. We are here because I know how to save your life. I can lead you to Mikoshi. Minen, Mikoshi don't exist in real space. Yet its access points do, and one is very near. Where? Here in Night City, beneath 
Arasaka Tower. We ought to leave. Right now. Wanna leave? What gave you that idea? Quit button in so I can hear her out. This is gonna be a disaster. Sit. We have little time. Sure know how to prick up my ears. Go on. Talk. My brother. You catch a whiff of that? Smells like shit. Careful not to step in it. He must be made to take responsibility for his deeds. Just say it. Be easier that way. I want him punished. Still vague. You want him dead. I want the Arasaka Corporation to know the truth. How you plan to do this? Yorinobu. Hanako-sama. Soro-soro gojitaku ni omodori itadaite. Sugu ni sumu wa. Yorinobu will soon call a meeting of the board. Representatives of all factions are expected to attend. The perfect moment for them to learn the circumstances of my father's death. I will get you into this meeting, and you will testify against my brother. Testify? Listen, mind if I'm straight with you? Help me get rid of Yorinobu. I will help you get rid of the construct. Don't like this at all. Sounds like you want to use me. No. I simply offer you an opportunity. Not the first to try. But what if I am the last? You cannot take that chance. We're getting the fuck out of here. Are you well? Yeah, it's just, um... You are bleeding. Fuck. It seems you are running out of time. Don't delay. Make your decision. No worries about that. You could use some air right now. Stand on your own two feet. While well, I'm good to go, body listens to me. See what I'm getting at? Yeah, I get it. And don't like it one bit. I'm still Come going on, strong. face the facts. Pop some pseudo endotrizine. Scooch and let me get behind the wheel. I'll get us to fucking Makoshi. Uh-huh. Oh, exactly. Without that porcelain cunt's help, that's for damn sure. Don't stand a chance without help. Right about that. But that's why I'll bring Rogue. She's not rusted through just yet. Plus, she owes me. Maybe she'd have stuck her neck out for you a half a century ago. But now... I don't see it. I'll convince her. After all, we know a thing or two about ops like this. We'll blast our way into Sokka Tower, just like we did back in the day. Then find the way inside Makoshi. It's our only chance. What about Pan Am? She offered help. Listen up, V. Those guys are trailer tuggers. An assault on our Asaka's just not another convoy to Jack. You already tried this with amateurs. Both know how that ended. And you... tried it with pros. Didn't end any fucking better. You don't want those people involved. Their lives on the line. Possibly on your conscience. Our one hope is sitting at the afterlife right now, and her name is Rogue. Dickhead, what's your scheme? This is my body. I make the Not best. this time. <laughs> Johnny! Jesus, look at you. Can't even. Great, you checking out again? What am I? 
No, it's not what you think. Not yet, anyway. Easy there. Don't move just yet. Vic. You're in pain, I know. Delirious when you arrived, so I had to dose you with beta haloperidol. But light oversensitivity is a good sign. Means your optic nerves aren't damaged. My head. Ah. Uh... Almost done stabilizing the biochip. No, feels like. Someone's using your head as a knife block? How. <clears throat> How'd I get here? Dragged yourself here, beat to hell and back. Gave Misty a hell of a fright. Then you shoved my patient at the time off the table and demanded you be treated immediately. Talamant was your guardian angel. Huh? I, uh, wasn't completely myself. Yeah, I know. And that's a bit worrying. So, <clears throat> how bad we talking? That bad, huh? All right. That should be a little better. Try sitting up carefully. I'll try. Think I'm getting some feeling back. <sighs> Sit slowly. Another victory. For the history books. Hmm. Well, looks like I can sit up, all right. But I can tell you don't have good news. How much longer is this going to go on? You tell me. Looking at you, not long at all. Next attack, you won't be able to crawl back here. You'll flatline in some back alley. This is your last chance to take matters into your own hands. Understand? I know, Vic. I'll try. Soon. No. You'll do it now. Now, see that setup over there? Yeah? What about it? You'll find a last dose of pseudo-endotrys in there. A gift from Misty. Want to give in to the voices in your head? Go ahead. Take a puff. Go silent. Get out. Or find another way. End things on your own terms. Got a little present for me over there, too. Blockers. Manage to walk those few yards to the table. The rest will be up to you, and you alone. You heard him. We've got one last chance. I'm taking the wheel. Endotrizine, Rogue Sokka Tower. Only way this is gonna work. Give it a fucking rest, Johnny. It's my decision. And I gotta think about it. Need to stretch your noodle? noodle. Fine. Fine. Just not, it's in, not this in this basement. V, Christ, you're talking out loud. Uh, out loud? What? Just go fix this thing. Think I can do it. Whatever you decide, let's make sure to get out of here first. Say, who won the bout? Oh, so you heard that. Did he get up? Walsh, was it? No, never does. You mean... It's a rerun. One I'd like to go back to. Why'd you get so mad, then, if you already knew who won? Oh, no, really. Guess I like to think about where Walsh might have tripped up. Any theories? Entering the ring against a stronger opponent, but feels a little strange to call that a mistake. Can't thank you enough for all you've done, Vic. 
Only wish I could have done more. Go on now. I want to close up. Take the meds and do what you gotta do, V. Thanks, Vic. Oh well. And you hang in there too. Good luck, kid. Hey, V, I heard. Well, your thoughts? Shouldn't have had to. Sorry about that. No need to be. I know what's going on. And I know it won't be easy for either of you. If you don't want to decide here, I know a much better place. Sure. Got a feeling Vic's had enough of me as is. Don't be mad at him. His chakras are all blocked up today. Plus, he's had too much coffee. And let me guess. My aura's sputtering? Mm-hmm. Afraid so. Sure. Lead the way. Why is this spot special? I took Jackie there once. It's not far. Jackie? What, what's he gotta do with any of this? You'll see. Come on. Top floor. He had the same glum face. Who, oh, Jack? This is it, Chica. I'm done for. Doesn't sound like the Jackie I knew. That was a long time ago. His mom had just found out he'd signed up with the Valentinos. Trust me. Senora Wells on one shoulder. Your gang Chumba's on the other. No choice can ever seem right. Mm-hmm. Life wasn't easy for my Jackie, but... He found the courage to bet on himself. After. I brought him here. Ah, oh, that's more like it. Air. See that? I'm here when I need to get away. Be alone with my thoughts. She's on to something. Ought to sit, mull through some shit yourself. Choice spot. So what? What did Jackie decide up here? Oh, you know. Gonna be a legend in this city. And I'm gonna leave you alone now. Take your time. Fucking scared me, know that? Thought you were on your way out. No, still here. For now. You know, should call anyone you want to say goodbye to. Worst case scenario. That what you expect? No. But whatever you decide, risk's gonna be high. If things don't go our way. Just fucking do it. Anyone you gotta talk to, now's the time. Pills can wait. Judy. Yeah, even I've grown to like her. She ought to know that. Hey, Judy. Oh, hey, V. What's cracking? Time we, uh, went swimming. A lot of fun, wasn't it? What you said then, about what you sensed in me. Death. Wish it had been anything else. Something nice. Hey, 
not like it was your fault. Here's hoping it comes out better next time. Listen, whatever it is you're gonna try, just be careful, okay? I'm here waiting. Thanks. Do my best. <sighs> okay. Was good you called. Wish I'd have had the chance to. Come a long way to get here, haven't we? Just think, it all started in a fucking landfill. <laughs> Man, you tried to kill me. See exactly what I mean. I'm trying to save your sorry hide now. You can let me do that, or you can try Pan Am and her tarmac rats. But then their lives will weigh heavy on your soul. Or you take Arasaka's deal, but then you'll have your own soul on your conscience. Think it's worth taking a chance on Arasaka? The fuck was that? God, how are you so fucking stubborn? Inherited your finest traits. You absolutely sure? No going back on this, you know. Yeah, just don't freak out. Honestly, couldn't give a gnat shit. Got a feeling you're gonna regret this decision. And the moment that dawns, I won't be there to help. Could be my last ride, this. If it don't work out. Just want to be there for it. Aware. See you inside, Makoshi. Johnny? Okay. Just me now. Your offer. I accept. You took your time. In the interim, Yorinobu has made his move. What do you mean? My brother has made me his guest at his residence in North Oak. Locked you in? Yes. His people watch over me for my safety. Yeah? Well, I'll get you out. Can be pretty persuasive. At Victor's, my ripper dock. Back behind a small shop called Misty's Esoterica. I will send someone for you. They will drive you to the residence. Then we shall visit my brother together at Arasaka Tower. Is that you, V? Or... Yeah, it's me. So, what now? Waiting for my driver. Come inside. We'll wait together. Since you have to wait, Mind if I give you a reading? Sure, why not? Some believe uncertainty is an evil that should be dispelled through divination. Others claim it's change that is evil. But that isn't true either. Every minute of every day, we each become someone new. We shouldn't fear change itself, but only who we might change into. Knowing one's path is most important. I devised this layout especially for you and Johnny. Your future is his future, and vice versa. Okay, I'm ready. We'll start with you, V. The Fool. <laughs> what a surprise. Let's dig deeper to find its meaning here. 
The Fool symbolizes the start of a journey, the announcement of something new. It's the inner child, curious of the world, but also naive and reckless. <laughs> Sounds a lot like the V I first met. The Magician. A person of great talent and charisma. A leader. Sounds like Johnny. The card is reversed. That can mean a tendency toward addiction, mental instability. Oh, okay, definitely Johnny. He has one great disturbance. The final cards are about your futures. The Devil. Whew, got another deck lying around? A cheerful one? This is no joke, V. An inverted devil symbolizes subjugation, losing control, aggression, evil, a power struggle. Whatever you're planning, treat this as a warning. <sighs> okay. And Johnny's? The moon. Well, that doesn't sound too bad, right? I don't know, V. The moon is mystery. I think that's for you. Wait, is that... an Arasaka stretch? That's right. But... V... They killed Jackie and... And now you're working for them? Still don't get it, do you? Jackie died. Cause we made a terrible fucking decision. And the rest... Just plain consequences. The cards weren't lying. You've changed. And my senses tell me it's for the worse. V, it's good to meet again. You look... like shit. I feel like shit. Lovely little shit. And it's getting worse. I'm sorry to hear this. We should go. Wait a minute. When we last saw one another, we spoke of a construct in your head that could influence your decision-making. The same construct that, in its former life, detonated two nuclear warheads inside Arisaka Tower. And now you and this construct have volunteered to sort out things in Arisaka. What is this about? Has no one told you? Shame. The engram inside is Johnny fucking Silverhand. Recognize the name? The terrorist. Yes, but he's suppressed now. With beta blockers. But before I did that, he warned me against working with Arasaka. So tuck your suspicions where the sun don't shine before I start regretting not taking his advice. That is enough for me. Let us go to the car. Hanako-sama is waiting. He may be satisfied. I will be watching you. We are almost there. Why has she not called? Hanako-sama, they may have cut communication at the residence. Something has gone wrong. Reckless driving will not improve the situation. I'm not your bloody chauffeur! didn't agree to this. None of us did. Matter of fact... You are awake. Don't remember conking out. Eyes open now. We'll arrive shortly. Weapons are dead already. Are you mad? We must act natural. Just... Everyone be still and calm, and this will all go smoothly.
Is everything in order? No one is allowed onto the estate. Jesus Christ! Efficient, effective, good work. Blast it all! <gasps> what now? They won't let us anywhere near her. We are not here to ask anyone's permission. Hellman, go and bring the AV here. Things will get very messy soon. B, you will come with me. I am in the bedroom in the central part of the building. And as you get the AV. But first, we must neutralize the four guards. Takemura, V, is your task clear? Uh-huh. We neutralize. I will obstruct their communications so that no support arrives. We will take the left side, through the garden. So, we must be there. I will go left. The right side is yours.
That is the last of your nobs people. I await you. Helmut, we are done. We need the AV. Now. He. Arasaka-sama. Run and get him. We'll be there soon. Blood was spilled. This is good. For now, could get a lot uglier down the line. You ready for that? Always. I believe a war has just begun. Mars, bit much, isn't it? Though a loaded word for any Arasaka. Is that what you believe? Just counting bodies. You, me, Goro, and Hellman makes four. Well, actually three and a half. There is Oda, too. We will meet him there. Pretty quick to get back on his feet. He was provided with excellent care. Anyway, against all our Saka and its armies, that's not much. My brother is not all of Arasaka. Not yet, at least. He knows this well. It is the reason he surrounds himself with criminals like Adam Smasher. That's supposed to make me feel better? Reality is, we're on our own. My father was on his own, and he built an empire. Please. Is it not too early for champagne? <coughs> but if it helps you calm down, does anyone else have trembling hands? No need. My hands are fine. I might beg to differ, V. <sighs> Felt better. How do you mean? Get these, uh, blackouts. Hellman? If I had to guess, her central nervous system is a shambles. Honestly, it's a miracle she can still walk. What's your tone? Or it is you who will find it hard to walk. Enough. We must make haste. Once Yorinobu has been dealt with, we shall attend to your needs. Did you prepare everything? Quite.
almost there. Takemura, gather your force. Every loyal soldier must stand ready. We shall await your signal. V, you must come with me. This way. Probably won't get another chance. To do what? To fill me in on your plan. What if I have none? Don't play dumb with me, Hanako. Mm-hmm. You and Takemura had a plan the day of the parade. Moments later, you had nothing. Your plan was in tatters. And yet we are here now. Do you know why? Because sometimes you have to look the truth in the eye. Back then, that is what I did, thanks to you. You have a, a very honest look. That's how we're swinging the Arasaka board. You want me to stare at them? Weapon at the ready. And if my charms don't work, we go for more tried and tested methods. I see what you're getting at. You have yet to see, as do they all. Where are we actually going? This is one of Arasaka's most closely guarded secrets. Hang on, is this? Father's office, a faithful replica of the original in Tokyo. He ordered one made in every Arasaka branch on the planet. Every last detail, every item, arranged as if he could navigate it blind. That is the way he is meticulous, fastidious. Was. I beg your pardon? Meant to say, was. Symbols are more resilient than you think. The question is, if the faction leaders remain loyal to Arasaka values, and if they will find the courage to admit their mistake. Odds of that happening are... Higher than you may think. Come. Going down? I told you. Mikoshi can be accessed only from a room beneath Arasaka Tower. Before we interrupt this board meeting, we must do one more thing. Huh? Keep getting this weird feeling you're not telling me the whole truth. Because I am not telling you the whole truth. I am cautious. Uh, you said we trusted each other. There is trust between us now. That is why you are here. Though earlier, soon after you abducted me, I sought his counsel. Uh, whose? Father's. His office is not the only replica he created. What? Because... 
ごくありふれた人間が時に重要な役割を担う運命のいたずらとでも言うべきか生と死その狭間にガラスがある私たちの使命はその境界を限りなく薄くすることだお前はそのプロセスの一部となった感謝しなくてはな Thanks won't be near enough. 心配するな。しかるべき代償は払う。準備はいいぞ、花子。はじめろ。お父様。It is done. We may go. Let's get out of here. <coughs> oh, Johnny, fuck no. no. Not now. <laughs> Be much longer, V. Will you stay with us? <sighs> Grown weaker by the minute. We gotta hurry. Indeed, we do. Dire moments are upon us. Shui, the Ayashi, you go kick out of a Tadashi, you go to Hanako. Good memory for faces, Oda. V is with us. Of course, Hanako Sama. Is it just these? The rest are in position, ready to do as instructed. These are the most effective by match and loyal. To me or to my money? I would say it's 20% to 80, Hanako Sama. Very well. It will have to do. Now come. You in on this? In on what? Saboro's comeback. Just spoke to his construct. What? He digitized his engram, made copies, in case he died. No, he would have told me. Why? So you'd take your job as his bodyguard lightly? How do you. Feel that, Goro? Night City just gave you another kick in the nuts. Run and start this time. If we cannot convince them, we could lose control of the situation. Then what? You mean to neutralize them, too? Keep your weapon at hand. And do not utter a word until I ask you to. No matter what happens, you must trust me. I am late. Apologies. Hanako, what are you doing here? My brother. Where is he? He told us to start without him. Then, begin without him, we shall. Begin what? The removal of Yorinobu from his position as CEO of Arasaka. Did I hear you correctly? What... What are you doing? You cannot... Oh, Hanako... 
I believe you owe us an explanation. V, this is your seat. Oh. Hear that? Plant your ass somewhere else. This is outrageous. Much obliged. Yorinobu murdered my father and exploited his death to justify his warmongering. And you knew of this. All of you. Fascinating. Absurd! Careful what you say. Yes, indeed. Worse than nothing else. Is this all you have? I have an eyewitness. It's true. All of it. Saw it with my own eyes. What did you see? I saw Yorinobu strangle Saburo Arasaka. Ah, more interesting with each minute. I can confirm this. Says a wanted man! A serious accusation, admittedly. But nothing more. If our testimony is not enough, perhaps you will listen to my father. Oh. This? Is this to convince us? A magic trick. わたしはこう言ったはずだ。お前には三つのものが欠けている。自身、自性、そして根性だ。荒坂様、見たところ、あれから何も変わっていないようだな。It's it's him. Objections? What the hell's happening? Clearly, someone objects. Who activated the lockdown? Is it you? Is this your doing, Hanako? To lock us in here so we devour each other like rats in a cage? Hear that? Have you brought more of this filth from no the one. street? I oh, ask you! Oh, they're here! Oh, they're here. Neutralized us. I did not believe he would go to such lengths. I will gather a force and take control of Arasaka Tower. You must find my brother. This lift will take you to the upper atrium. From there, you can reach Yorinobu's floor. Hanako-sama, I can be of assistance. So be it. But he is not to be harmed. You are to capture him, nothing more. He is still my brother. If you harm a hair on his head, our agreement will be void. I will cover her. Hajimena Go! Takemura-san, V, I wish you the best of luck.
you to die. was wrong about the Orinobu. The Arasaka board, his own sister. He's not simply deceitful, he is insane. <sighs> Won't be long now. We'll nab him. My people are ready. They await my orders. What should I tell them? An open attack? Can't be nice. Not anymore. We attack. Full force. Good. Very good. A fight to the death. No prisoners. Listen, we must take the atrium! Way upon spreading. Fire! Got a problem. They've disabled all the elevators. Get down! My people will take back the control room shortly. Come to the lift in the middle on level 3. Quickly! <coughs> Thank you. 
Approaching target!
The lockdown has been lifted. Be very careful. Your numbers men are certain to be in position. I will join you once we have the situation under control. 2067. An Arasaka bodyguard shields the Emperor of Japan from an assassin's bullet. 2071. Arasaka security forces prevent mass riots in San Francisco, saving the city from certain ruin. 2074. An Arasaka investigation eliminates a terror cell in Rio de Janeiro, ending a string of attacks and executing those responsible. 2076. Hey, you have received death from our support. <laughs> <laughs> haven't met me yet. My netrunners have dealt with the doors. You can keep moving. As if they were gonna make this easy. Your mate is oh, fuck. Adam Smasher. I fucking knew it! Uh. Trust me, I know. Mercy! Struggle if you wish! I will grasp your hate through heart! Reloading! 
Guards are taken care of. There is a large room ahead. My brother's most you know capable men guard it. Get ready. Yorinobu employs some exceptional. Kuzutomo. They haven't met me yet. My netrunners have dealt with the doors. You can keep moving. They were gonna make this easy. Your meat is fed. Oh, fuck. I fucking knew it. Be careful, I know. I will pass you a hate through home. Finally. What? 
You're taking... How about that, Johnny? <sighs> that was for you. Rightly so. He did not deserve mercy. Almost. There. I am as well. Remember, do not harm a hair on his head. I remember. Privilege is all yours. I will stay here. If I go through that door, I will kill him. And your agreement with Hanako-sama will be undone. It is the last favor I can do for you. Thanks, Goro. Can't believe we actually pulled it off. Go, B. Finish what we started. Violent delights with violent ends. You? Where is my sister? Mean your beloved sibling, one your men almost shot and killed? She was to remain at the estate. Stay out of the way. I tried to protect her. Any danger she was in was because of you. No one else. Where is she? Be here any sec now. Till then. I'm supposed to watch you. So don't try anything. What would I try? I have tried everything. Nothing else remains. This... you won't need. Just one bullet left. It's not for you. Look. What do you see? A guy who lost. Just one? I see millions. Kyoto. Dubai. Paris. These people had a chance today, but they lost it. A chance? A chance for what? To forget their fear. This is nonsense. No. Fear. Ever since I can remember, the one thing I cannot deny him, he knew. How to cause fear in people. Saboro. He once told me anything of value is only a flag blowing in wind. And wind is fear. And then, you know what he did? Blew in my face. That was the one time he was wrong. And others? It worked on them. They feared him. Even now, you saw. Idiots terrified of a dead man talking from a box. Pathetic. I would change that. If only you did not appear. Wouldn't it change a damn thing? You were exactly like him. All you want is power. Power? Huh. Truly, power? V, 
Fifty years ago, terrorists blew this building into smoke. Yeah. So I heard. And? What did it give us? Not much. Nothing. But I learned lesson. If planting bombs not enough, what can you do? You become bomb. And then call. Nisa. I thank you, V. That will be all. Not all. Not yet. I will keep my end of our agreement. You will go with Helman. And you? I must stay with my brother. Come. Time to look to your problem. Fate is a fickle mistress, isn't she? Say what now? You spend your whole life fighting something. Only to become that very same thing. Quite literally. I did it. Johnny, Hanako kept her word. Looking at you now reminds me of the moment we met. Still see that same small time mark. Little thief with her head in the clouds. Haven't changed a bit. Jesus, can you stop being a prick for just a minute? You know, you remind me of someone. The Johnny of yore never gave a shit about anyone. Betrayal came easy, something to brag about. Wait, that's what you think? I betrayed you? Worse. Lots. You betrayed yourself. The hell you mean by that? Biochip did more than just blend our memories. That line that kept V and Silverhand separate, well, faded a while back. I'm still here. I know what I want, and I know where I came from. I, I, I. Who's this I? You even know? Same V who was left to die in that landfill. Nothing's changed. And your will to fight? To tell Death to go fuck himself? Where's that come from? Always had that. That's who I am. How can you be so sure? I mean, when you reach back, how can you be sure whose memories you're dipping into? We're a tangled web, you and me. One in the same. So if you're here to tell me something, it's because you need to hear it yourself. Wanna part ways on good terms, Johnny? 
as friends. Not sure that's possible anymore. Listen, I'm on an operating table getting sliced open. Our Osaka docs are taking the chip out as we speak. I mean, you knew it'd end this way. That the day would come when I'd want to be normal again. Want my life back. Normal's overrated. If it exists at all, they're cutting a piece of us out. And that'll leave a hole forever. What choice did I have? Stay true to yourself? Give a thought to a tiny concept called loyalty? If you're all paranoid about being thrown in another Arasaka prison, don't be. They're gonna shred you. You're never gonna get it. It's not about Arasaka. Not even about life and death. Then what's it all about, Johnny? Enlighten me. The principle, V. It's always about the principle. Swap meat for chrome, live a BD fantasy, whatever. But at the end of it all, it's the code you live by that defines who you are. Ever get lost? It shows you the way home. Bust up into pieces? It puts you back together again. That rocker boy Silverhands credo? Words he lived by? Something Johnny picked up from V. The old V. I, I don't want to drag this out. Just see you around, Johnny. And thanks for everything. If not for you, I'd be long dead. Several times over. Remember what Dex asked you? Quiet life, or blaze of glory? Sure, I remember. Shame you chose wrong. Damn shame. In addition, numerous brain functions remain dormant. The neural impulses have been rerouted to the neural processor, a temporary measure. When can I expect a full report? I will send it by the end of this week. My congratulations again on your success. Goodbye. Please prepare the patient's room. Having trouble remembering how I got here. Some memories you have lost permanently. Others will return in time. You must stay calm. Your neural processor is overburdened. Any unnecessary stress response will only make things worse. Am... Am I still V? I... I died? Do I say I... Everything is in order. No. I... Who am I? Please take the patient away. Notepad. Progression and its further trajectory remain unclear. Removing the tumors proved a difficult task. But the operation on the engram was the real challenge. Is the ship of Theseus, dismantled into component parts Let's and go. reassembled, still the same ship? We are pioneers, the first to ever separate mentally conjoined twins. Yes, in the end, even the human soul can go when into Kyoto. End of note. I hear the cuckoo calling and long for Kyoto. Uh huh? Please rest. A doctor will be with you shortly.
Come here. Waiting for you. was made before his death. It appears his consciousness was used to override that of his son and heir, Yorunobu Arasaka. This shocking development was revealed at a press conference earlier today.人類最大の恐怖が克服されました。私、サブロー・アラサカは今息子の体を使い皆さんの前に立っています。私はかつてヨリノブに生を与えました。彼は愛する父のためにそれを返してくれたのです。私のいない間、ヨリノブは会社を変革しようと、いくつかの決定を下しました。これは過ちでした。私の指揮のもと。荒坂社は元の姿を取り戻します。決して揺らぐことのない強い荒坂が帰ってくることを約束いたします。ご清聴ありがとうございました。Today is truly a historic day. Today, technology has fulfilled the promise left empty by religion. Saburo Osama, Makoto ni Omedatou. Please get ready. Testing will begin shortly. We must complete a series of tests. Please do not hinder or delay. Parietal lobe examination. Please use your Kiroshi scanner and read the displayed text. And it was a sight to behold, he said, how a soul would choose its life. Sometimes pitiable, sometimes laughable. At times, wonderful and strange. That's enough. Cognitive function test. Solve the cube. Hmm. Please link yourself to the device. Higher order representation formation, initiating test. The patient is ready to be examined. A higher order representation what? Engram surgery carries an elevated risk of the onset of personality disorder. The test is essential. What's this thing majig for? It measures pupillary response. What are these tests meant to Test. Initiate device calibration. Respond to the keywords. No thinking, just the first word that comes to mind. Journey. Freedom. Home. Johnny. Enemy. Johnny. 
Principal. Me. Betrayal. I don't know. You're in a cornfield. Tall, green plants, as far as the eye can see. The sun is bright, blinding. The stalks of corn part as you walk forward. You come across a clearing left by an automated combine in its wake. What's this test for, anyway? It tests your level of empathy. The heat has made your mouth dry and sticky. You spot a rodent's nest at your feet. The machine has torn through the soft soil. You spot blind, newborn field mice around their mother. The machine has left her sliced in two. They lie in perfect symmetry, a tiny rodent rosette. Your mouth begins to water. What's wrong with me? A shadow gradually falls over the ground. The first rain cloud of the year. Hmm. Yes, right. Measurements complete. How'd I do? We will see. Motor function test. Please step onto the treadmill. Motor function test. Please connect to the device. What's this test all about? Please walk. Gradually accelerate. What? Shit. Get up. You can't stay here. News. I'm Jillian Jordan. The world remains gripped by the revelation that Saburo Arasaka has returned from the dead in the body of his son, Yorinobu Arasaka. A letter of protest regarding the apparent resurrection has been signed by religious leaders, human rights groups, and Virtue 100 company CEOs. This is an abomination born of unchecked vanity, technocratic arrogance, complete moral collapse. Our position is clear. Saburo Arasaka's seizure of power is in violation of international law. International arbitration is absolutely necessary to... Do we really want to live in a world where the rich and powerful can become immortal? Where they can continue to take from the poor not only their livelihoods, but even their bu- You are gods! You are gods! You are gods! You are gods! But Saburo Arasaka has issued his response in similarly strong terms. There will be no appeasement. Arasaka Shanaibu no dekigoto ni kanshite. Gaibu no katagata ni toyakaku iwareru sujiwai wa arimasen. Sei o ukeru koto ni kyoka ga hisyo nai ijo. Yomigaeru koto mo doyo de aru to kangaeru beki desu. Watashi ga musuko o ayameta nado to yu shicho wa jijitsu mukon. Oh, 
Please get ready. Testing will begin shortly. Any results from the tests you already did? No, we are not done yet. Today we begin a new series of tests. Fine. Hit me. Let's get this done. Cognitive function test. Solve the cube. Next test, please connect your personal link. Higher order representation formation, initiating test. The patient is ready to be examined. Same thing, again? We need very precise data. Why can't I solve the fucking cube? That is what I'm trying to determine. Let's start this thing. Device calibration. Please respond to each keyword with your initial association. As quick as I can, no thinking, got it. Illness. Johnny. Rebellion. Me. I, me. Transformation. The present. Nothing, I don't know. The future. Death. You're in a cornfield. Tall green plants as far as the eye can see. The sun is in your eyes, bright, blinding. The stalks of corn part as you walk forward. You come across a clearing left by an automated combine in its wake. The heat's made your mouth dry and sticky. You spot a rodent's nest at your feet. The machine is torn through the soft soil. You spot blind, newborn field mice around their mother. The machine has left her sliced in two. They lie in perfect symmetry, a tiny rodent rosette. Your mouth begins to water. A shadow gradually covers the ground. The first rain cloud of the year. Measurements complete. We will now move on to the motor function test. Please step onto the treadmill. Motor function test. Personal link. Really aced it last time, didn't I? Slow walk. No, no point to this. The tests are not. Not treadmill. Hmm. Testing concluded for today. Communications have been unlocked. You may now phone home. Earth. Hello? Well, about damn time, V. Been trying to reach you for days now. Had a lot on my mind. A lot going on. What the hell happened to you? Got the chip out of my head. No, really? You're joking. No, just had the procedure. Not feeling so hot. Where are you? Orbital station, Arasaka. Think I'm gonna puke. V, you idiot. Get back down to Earth now. Doctor up here's a real cunt, let me tell you. 
torturing me with stupid tests all the time. Don't take anything they give you. Nothing. Might sound cliche, but feels like they're hiding something. Okay, enough. Get a grip. Grab a shuttle and get your ass back home. You know, I think I might be losing my mind. Oh, fuck. This place, it's killing me. V, you even hear what you're saying? I mean, Arasaka. You let him take you into orbit, dig around in your head, and now you think to complain? It's so good to hear your voice. I'm just... I'm so glad you're here. There. Fuck, V. I thought you were dead. I don't know what I'll do if I ever find out you're gone. Really want to see you again. I'm gonna hang up. And I want to see you back on Earth. In hours. No. Now. Hey. Hey, P. Look, um, season finale of Little Big Corporal Rats is on in a minute, so, uh, call you back later, huh? Okay. Yeah, never mind. Have fun. Will do. See ya. Hey. Hey. Wow, it's been a while since I heard that voice. How's things at your end? I'm in the middle of a meeting with Mitch. He wants me to hang up. He's signaling wildly. Tell him to get lost. Tell him I said that. He says hello. To you and your venerable mother. Listen. I'm stuck in a shithole. It sucks. Hard. So leave the shithole. Come home. Not that simple. No is a nice word. Beautiful sometimes. You should use it more often. Sorry, Mitch is about to blow a fuse. I'll have to call you back. Hey. Randy, leave the damn dog alone, I said. Wow. Been a while, V. Been going through some shit. A lot of changes. What happened? You all right? Got rid of the biochip. It's out of my head. Well, that good or bad news? Don't know that yet. Just had the procedure. Randy, get the hell out of here. Which hospital are you at? <sighs> Not at a hospital. Arasaka Orbital Station. Then tell me which one. I'll fly out and get you back here. <laughs> I don't even know the station's name. Don't worry, I'll find it. I'll figure it out. Nobody tells me anything here. You just sit tight. Take care of yourself. Stay out of trouble till I get there. You know, I think I might be going a little crazy up here. And you could finish doing that on Earth. It's Arasaka V. Not Rippers without borders. Don't you dare let them hurt you. So glad I've got you. Yeah, good. I don't want to lose you. So take good care of yourself until I get there. Uh, Justin, and the kids, how are they? And is Randy back? Yeah. Yeah, he's back. It's all fine. Look, I gotta go. I'm gonna find you. Hear me? How's it going? Hey, think I ought to ask you the same. Got rid of the biochip. Arasaka do it? Yep. Sitting on their orbital station. All right. So once you get back, pay me a visit, huh? You're gonna need a thorough checkup. How's Misty? Well, after you left, she went off to visit her folks. For a while, most likely. Got a postcard from her, from Warsaw. There's a polar bear on it. Tell her I said hi when she gets back. You'll tell her yourself. 
Yeah, so to be honest, been better. What am I supposed to do long distance over the phone? I just wanted to talk, Vic. <sighs> Look, we go back long enough that you know I'm no good at this stuff. And Misty's out of town. What am I supposed to do? Get a grip. Make a decision. You already showed yourself and me. You can do it. <sighs> Thanks for the pep talk, Vic. Sounds like a plan. Cognitive function test. Solve the cube. longer we need very precise data I can't stand this anymore cognitive function test solve the cube It up. Respond to the key words. No thinking, just the first word that comes to mind. Loyalty. No idea. Please respond to each term with the first thing that comes to mind. Quick as I can, no thinking, right? Humanity. Enough! No more tests. I refuse to take any. Please step onto the treadmill. As quickly as you can, without thinking about it. V. Hanako Arasaka. Wanna to talk to her? No.
Cognitive function test. Solve the cube. Fuck! No, enough! I've had it! Fucking hate this place! What are you doing here? I have come to speak with you. It is an awful place. It is no wonder you are losing your mind. Come all the way here to take me home? They asked me to speak with you. Sasaburo Arasaka's back. And you are Nobu's body. Yes. Justice has been done. So... Got your revenge? Feel satisfied? I believe Hanako Arasaka chose the best solution. Sporo should have stayed dead. Many wish him dead, but he will survive them all. Sorry. Guess I'll never understand what you see in the guy. You did not spend your life at his side and... Well... I did not come here to talk about the Arasakas. What are you gonna do now? Still aim to protect Saburo's ass? I have been transferred to Japan. I will fly from here to Takamats. Why? New times, new duties. But we say far too much about me. Fine. So what is it you gotta tell me? I am sorry to say, it is not good. I will be blunt. The surgery did not help. You will be dead before winter. How? How is that possible? Arsaka's got the best and brightest. No, no. The operation was a success. And that is why. But the changes the chip made were too great. Even for the corporate neurosurgeons. This is fucking Arasaka. They should figure something out. You must accept the truth. Then listen to what I say. There are options. Dead in a few months. That's me, huh? You will feel better at first. But then the illness will grow fierce. Attack in full force. Your final weeks, you will spend in bed. Fuck. Please, feel no anger. I wish to speak about an alternative. Said Arasaka would fix me if I helped you, you promised. I believe truly they could. Said you had powerful friends. Where are those friends now? I did not come with empty hands. We must speak about your options. Hanako Arasaka promised to save my life. It is the reason she sent me here. To discuss the alternative. What are you talking about? Trusted you all once already. You let me down. You may join the Secure Your Soul program. Hanako Arasaka has agreed to it. You will leave your body. Arasaka will store your engram in Mikoshi until a way is found to transfer it to a new body. Store? Can't I get a new body right off? With technology as it is now, this is impossible. Seemed pretty damn possible for Saburo Arasaka. He returned in his son's body. 
tissue compatibility made things easier. Yet your phenotype, thanks to the chip, is unique. Arasaka cannot provide a suitable body at this time. Sorry, not buying it. Arasaka's have to lock me up. You overstate your importance. To the Arasakas, I fear you are nobody, were nobody. With this offer, Hanako Arasaka rewards you generously for your service. There's not, as you say, more to the story. Nope. Doesn't sound good to me at all. I agree to this, and they'll do whatever they want with me. There will be a contract to protect you. Sign it, and you will live. It is written here that you relinquish all rights, but do not worry. The law is simply behind the times, and Ingram is not legally a person. So I get to be corporate property first? Like many brain dance stars and politicians from what I know, the program is a success. There have been no complaints. And if I say no? This is not a prison. You will take your things and return to Night City. Why are you? I would sign. But the choice is yours. Think it through carefully. Made my decision. Going back to Earth. Going home. You will die, dear. You're all right, Takamura. I like you. Thanks for coming all the way up here to help. But one thing you never understood, and never will. What is that? Got no idea how sweet it is to be free. You speak out of bitterness. Please reconsider. No. This here's goodbye. But I'm not gonna forget you. What we did together. Goodbye, B. Thing of beauty will never fade away. I see your eyes, I know you see me. You're like a ghost, how you're everywhere. How's the Earth looking from way up there? She is pretty as they say? Or is that just another lie? Listen, don't forget, your implants were made for Earth gravity. Could start acting up in orbit. What I'm trying to say is, don't ignore any error warnings, okay? And when you're back, I mean, if you come back, I'll do a full checkup. Maybe even give you a little discount. Take care, V. Hey, V. 
Everyone's telling me you're a base gordo now. A big shot, eh? <laughs> so big you can't call me once a week. Once a month, even. Don't forget where you started. Who you started with, hmm? My door's always open to you, V. There's always food on my table. Mi casa es su casa. No se te olvide. Ahí te veo, V. Hey, V. I'm just, uh... I'm calling to say goodbye. I finally decided to up and leave this city for good. Realize this place only gives you two choices. You either become an asshole, or eventually you get off by one. I hope you somehow find an alternative. It's just a shame things had to end this way. Have a nice life, V. Hello, V. How are things? Weather in the Badlands is pleasant as usual. My cooler melted, it's 90 degrees in the shade, and there's sandstorms heading straight for us. So yeah, you're missing out. No, but seriously, we're doing all right. Saul and I somehow get along, for better or for worse. But still, family's always growing, work's always piling up. But better to keep busy, right? And to think if it wasn't for you, I'd still be stumbling my way through Night City. So I just want to say thank you. For all you've done for me. I'd still be lost if you hadn't set me on the right track. All right, well, talk soon, V. Don't be a stranger. Hello, V. Um, Saul speaking. Heard about something big happening in Night City, with a certain V in the lead role. Uh, don't know what you plan to do now, but just remember, we always take care of our own. And, um, you're one of us now, V. You're an Alda Caldo. Remember that. Ah, uh, take care of yourself, V. And see you around. V, hey! Can you hear me? Shit, is this thing recording? Okay, well, all of us have been wondering when you're finally gonna drop by. We can get a barbecue going, knock a few back, do a couple of races, or pay a friendly visit to the Raff and Shiv. Guess what I'm trying to say is, well, Badlands could use a badass like you, V. Don't know what you got on your plate right now. But remember, you're welcome out here anytime. All right, now, take care. Hey, Rogue here. I wanted to... Oh, voicemail. <laughs> Why not? V? I was wondering if you could pass a message along to Johnny. Two messages, actually. One, that he's an arrogant, egotistical son of a bitch. And second, that it was nice to talk to him again. Both of you, take care of yourselves, okay? Hey, V, so funny thing just said. Oh, fuck, fuck, sake, voicemail again. Do you ever answer the phone? Like, ever? Seriously, I can get through to data term customer service faster than you. Uh, what did I even want? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know that us cracks agent called me and asked if I would go on tour with them? At first, I was like, over oh, my dead fucking body. But then I thought, hey, wait. I could actually be fine. So, uh, who knows? Well, there's the latest gossip for you, if you even care. Call me back when you can, okay? Bye! B, hey. So, here's the thing. A couple fellas from the 5th Precinct busted a shop selling illegal iron. Sawed-offs, stun guns, mustard gas canisters. Orders from on up were to blow it all to the ground. But then I thought, maybe there's a better way to use all this stuff. For a good cause. 
I still remember what you did for us. For me and Randy. This city needs more people like you. I'm gonna make sure they're equipped. This one's on me, V. See you around. Hello, V. From what I understand, you have less than six months to live. I do not know how you plan to spend this time. Perhaps you have chosen to put your feet up, rest, ponder life's meaning. Or perhaps you continue to do what you are good at. If that is the case, my father and I would gladly retain your services. You would be compensated generously. Six months will pass faster than you imagine. It would be a shame to let this time go to waste. Hey, it's Peralvez. V, you're gonna want to hear this. But first, you need to go somewhere no one's listening. Okay, so my wife, Elizabeth, she's in on the whole thing. She, she keeps saying I should look after myself. Tells me to take these pills. Says they're vitamins. Got them analyzed at a lab. And they look okay. But, but how am I supposed to know if somebody didn't falsify the results? Well, 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 when, when you got a sec, call me, okay? Oh, yeah. And don't forget to delete this message. Hey, V. Orbital connections cost an arm and a leg, so I'll just get right to it. I was just thinking about you, so I laid out a quick tarot and... Oh dear. The Fool, the Moon, the High Priestess. Those, uh... Those are bad cards. Keep a close eye on your new friends, V. I mean it. 